Day evening, everyone. Thank you for being here with us. I'm Bray Blanks. Glad you're here. I'm Wayne McCormick. After an armed robbery at Abilene Christian University, ACU police are working to help people feel a little safer on campus again. K-Texas crime reporter Ariana Garza spoke to campus officers today. And Ariana, what did they say they're doing? Bray, they say they've always had a strong presence on campus with their 24-hour patrols, but now they're making an intense effort to be seen. What we want to do is uh, be more visible and be more reassuring to, to the campers and the people that are on our campus that, uh, and that we're out there. After a leadership camp staff volunteer was robbed at gunpoint in ACU's Barrett Residence Hall parking lot Monday morning, ACU police want people on campus to feel safe again. We want to make sure we're out either on foot or on a bike or near a car. In addition to increased visibility, Lieutenant Randy Motes has been meeting with camp volunteers to remind them of general safety precautions. Walk in well-lit areas, travel in groups, um, lock your car doors, don't leave anything valuable inside your car, make yourself a hard target, not an easy target. He says the university advises all students about these safety tips every year, but it doesn't hurt to be extra cautious in light of recent events. The campus is also sprinkled with several emergency call booths, and they already have a service in place for students who don't feel safe at night and need a police escort to their destination. And in case of emergency, ACU police say they can respond to any location on campus within one to two minutes. ACU police say they've received phone calls from concerned parents, but they say they feel more reassured after the armed robbery arrests were made within 24 hours. I think we all do. And here are the facts on the ACU Police Department. They've been on campus for more than 25 years. They have 15 officers on staff. Many used to actually serve on the Abilene Police Department. And they say they have a combined about 250 years of experience.